Official statistics place East Africa's population at 140 and growing at 2.5 percent every year. This, according to experts, is a red flag. The African public intellectuals are being dishonest. We are not adequately saying that we have a crisis of population. We are still pretending we have a demographic dividend. In 2050, Africa's population is projected to increase by 900 million people. The countries producing the most people are the ones with the least ability to invest in them as internationally competitive human resources. Dr. Makisa Kitui, the United Nations Conference on Trade and Development Secretary General, also advises that the time is now for countries to work towards enhancing regional and global competitiveness in trade. The Africans of the future, as a human resource developed by East Africa and the rest of Africa, will be going to Europe on a dreamliner. They will not go by boat to Lampedusa. And the way we do it, how do you create the infrastructure to make trading out of Africa competitive? Because we have ups and down challenges that are unimaginable. Our, our, our ranking as a country to do business, we are at number 160 out of 196, 196 countries. So how does a country at that level uh, have rules at the, uh, competing with countries that are at number, number one or number five? It just doesn't make sense.